Alright, let's stock up on some leprechauns. Leprechauns! Hey everyone, so for Cheesecake, and welcome to Earthworm Gym 3D. Alright, I was originally gonna play Pilot Wing 64, but the game kept crashing on me. I don't know why, not crashing, but freezing, I guess. It was really ticking me off, so I don't know if I'll have to get a new one or what. But I'm gonna throw you all some throwback, some 64 gaming. And uh, we're going to play Earthworm Jim 3D. Alright, so I'm going to have to erase one of these files. I'll erase this first one. I didn't get very far. You join us in County Hospital. Our hero is in bad shape. This latest cow bashing has turned in the brain to worm mush. Things look pretty bad. Only America can save our boy now. Our boy. At his bedside, close family and celebrity buddies fear the worst. Of course, Elvis. They're powerless to help the, nur the, the nurse, searching for a sign, shakes his head. Now the battle is in Jim's mind. Which is a pretty brutal battle, because Earthworm Jim has a wacky mind, and you'll see. See, I played this game a long time ago, and then I played it again. Like, maybe a, a year or so ago. But I didn't get very far. By the way, Earthworm Jim is a total bad A. So I gotta voice him as a total bad A. Alright. Earthworm Jim, is that you? Uh, eh. I don't know. I feel sort of funny. I feel smaller? Yeah, that's it. Smaller, but groovier. I am Peter Puppy, your best friend and brain tour guide. You must be Jim's super ego. Released by your brains as the last line of defense to stop total lobal annihilation. What is this place? Is there a restroom in here? I really gotta go. This is Brain Central, the fuse box of your mind. It's where your four warm brains connect, and no, you'll have to wait. Right now, the brains are in turmoil, and your sanity is in danger. Your worst fears and anxieties have been released and are trashing your tiny mind. Face up to it, Jim. You've lost your marbles. You better get them back. And if you haven't played this game before, you actually do collect marbles, so it's pretty funny. No mere thought is mightier than the super ego of Earthworm Jim. Bring on the bad guys. Not just yet, buddy. Before you can go there, I am contractually obliged to supply some information. Collect your marbles to fix the fabric of your mind. The more you get, the higher your IQ will be. And as you get smarter, the doors will open up in your head. Finding golden udders will recharge the power of the sacred cow of contemplation. It controls the portals to your brains and your only chance for full recovery. Take this first utter and begin your quest. And remember, from Jim, your brain is a dangerous place. I know that phrase all too well. Alright, give me those udders. Alright, looks like he's flipping it off or something. Alright, let's roll right into this. Here we go. This is memories, right? Or memory, excuse me. Alright, go drinking it. But playing is a baggy pipe. By the way, this game is completely normal. There's nothing weird about this game at all. Booger. Use the camera to explore your head. See that? Oh, wait. I don't need to say that. Okay, I know this already. Alright, let's talk to this dude. Who dares confront the sacred cow of memories at a shiny altar? It is I, Earthworm Jim. Superhero turned super ego. Can it be the chosen worm? Actually, you've come at a bad time. Could you call back? Don't stand in my way, Cal. I've been sent to fix things. Your arch enemy, <laughs> enemy Psycho, has invaded this brain and fixated on a single bad memory. You might not think you remember the terrible farmyard war of 7 2, but you do. You were still a child when the war ended, but it was locked in your mind. Now you must travel into the past to resolve the conflict between the beasts and end this clucking hell. I don't think I've caught that before, <laughs> but they, they got substitute curse words like I have, like fudge or whatever. By the great warm spirit, I will right this wrong. No crow messes with my head. Before you go to work, you'll need to know about getting into your mind. The doors around here will only open when you find enough marbles. Break the marble high score in each area of your brain to increase the total marble count. Use this. Yeah, okay. 
I'll open the first door for free. And watch out, worm guy. It's a farmyard out there. Woo! Alright. About to roll right in. It's a farmyard out there. Yep. Alright, let's do this. Woo! Alright, I'm gonna try to avoid the... Uh, I was gonna avoid them. I mean, I appreciate it, booger buddy, but... Alright. So, uh, this is gonna be... Fudge. I screwed up. Okay, this is kind of like the tutorial spot. Anyway, I'll use this as a uh, point to talk to you guys. This is going to be my platform game of the cycle. I forget if I said that already. So I was going to um, play Pilot Wing. But obviously that didn't work. So I'm playing this game. And normally I try to go for the games that I haven't played before. Uh, or at least played in a while. But I... I had to go with Earthworm Jim, because one, Earthworm Jim freaking rocks, and two, I don't know, fudge! And two, I want to do a throwback for you guys, I don't know if I'm supposed to, oh, 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 yeah, yeah, that's right. Okay, see, I should be, okay. Right. Huh. on. There we go, that's what I wanted to do. Alright, so, um, I don't remember what I was talking about. Screw it, let's just have fun playing Earthworm Jim. Alright, I remember these dudes. How do I whip? Okay, there we go. I know if you whip them again, you can actually kill them, but I don't want to do that. Because they're so cute. You're so cute, yes you are. Alright, can I, can I go up there? Probably not. Alright. There's nothing up there. Why would I go up there? Is that it? Yeah, that's it. Oh, he's greeting me. Alright, bring out the baddies. Let's do this. Wait. Oh, crap. Okay. <laughs> just love how the bones shooting out of them and rockets. I don't like the rocket part though. Woo! Freaking refrigerators. <laughs> yeah, as far as my reactions go to this game, I mean. I did play through the, the full uh, first part. Fridge is launched, of course, yeah, whatever. Uh, I did play through the whole first part of this game. Uh, the whole memory area. About a year and a half ago or something. Cool, got it. And uh, I'm not going to try to fake my reactions. I don't, I don't like doing stuff like that. But I'll try to, you know, not make it dull and not say anything. So anyway, alright. Okay, so that's, this is the part where the barrels come flying down. Old explosive barrels of crap. And then there's a... I don't know who that is. I forget his name. It's like Major Bird or some crap. I have to go find his briefs. Eddie, hey, soldier! You're the sorriest looking chicken I've ever seen. Merciful mung beans! It's Colonel Pluckett to the great war hero! That's right, son. And I've got a mission for you. A mission for me? Oh, groovy! Those treacherous cows have enlisted to help the hedgehog mercenaries. The prickly pranksters have stolen my briefs. Your top secret battle plans? No, my underwear. Get them back for me, son. Chicken kind depends on it. No problem, Pluckett. You can be, you can debrief me when I get back. <laughs> oh, you know what? I, I... Alright, hold on. I, I, I didn't even catch that the last time I played this, but... I mean, obviously I know what debriefing is, but... Oh... I guess birds do eat worms, but don't. All right, get all these marbles, all two of them. Here we go. All right, the camera angles kind of suck. I'm not gonna lie. It's like freaking uh, uh, oh, pandemonium. The, the, their camera angles weren't the best. Alright, which way do I want to go? I'll go this way. Freaking little baby chicks. Okay, so they, they don't get any re recoil. I'm just gonna have to hit the crap out of them. There we go. Oh, yeah. Getting debriefed. Hey guys, let's just roll... Hey guys, let's just roll right into this. Okay, there's his briefs. Alright, let's do this. Oh, this part was kind of a pain. Okay, that that's one reason for the pain. These 
weasels. Actually, they're, what, hedgehogs? A bunch of fake Sonics. They're like Robotnik Sonics, because they shoot a bunch of crap at you. They're like robotic. Alright, give me the Leprechaun gun. Here we go. Leprechaun. Leprechauns! Yeah. Alright. <laughs> so yeah, you're, you guys are about to see how wacky this game is. I mean, if you haven't seen it already. Shoot Leprechauns. Alright, there you go. But yeah, I think I'm supposed to kill all these dudes first. Freaking leprechauns. I feel great. Oh, I need more leprechauns. I need some leprechauns. Alright. Oh, I didn't know they were homing. That's pretty cool. Alright. Oh, oh, crap. I thought that was the thing where the thing was. Oh, there it is. All right. Freaking go up there. Okay, he just skipped that one completely. Oh no, I'm gonna try to get all the marbles, or at least as many as possible, which would be a hundred. So I guess I was stupid to say. All right, get the fudge out of here. All right. It is important to get a lot of marbles because. When I played this as a kid, freaking wake up! There we go. When I played this as a kid, I I got to uh, the fourth um, I don't know, worm brain, I guess you could say. I got to the fourth worm brain, and I couldn't get to the second level of the fourth worm brain because I didn't have enough marbles, and I just I, don't know, I wasn't skilled enough to get all of them. So yeah, I'm gonna try to maximize my whatever's they're called marbles did i ever tell you my commentary sucks did he he just hit his own dude i think oh ooh. dodging rockets give me those leprechauns leprechauns all right he suck on a leprechaun i think the leprechaun sucked on him Ooh. <laughs> right in the butt all right Surprise! He he blocked my leprechaun. Oh, that mother effer! Here we go. Oh, is that the one that was over here? It is. I could just I could jump and get that. Hmm. Look, I can smell it from here. All right. Here we go. Let's get these marbles quick. Get that one. Boom. Boom. Wait. All right, crud. Crud. Hold on, I gotta get this one. I can't tell where it is. The depth, the, the depth of perception is off. All right, here we go. Oh, okay, we got three. I got you. I got you. I got plenty of bullets for all y'all. All right, get the freak to work. I feel great. Me too. Alright, let's stock up on some leprechauns. Leprechauns! Crap. Okay, there we go. Alright, who want it? Who want it? Look, I'm getting followed by health. This is awesome. That was too easy. Now, where's that one at? That one? Oh, that's right here. Okay. So I'm gonna need to... Totally miss. Whatever. Alright, let's go. Alright, almost at 50. Oh boy. Should have saved some leprechauns. That's okay, I got skills. That's all I need. Hey, don't hit my hamster, dude. You guys are pretty much the same type of animal. Alright, there, there we go. Alright. Bring me the briefs. Woo! Give me that. By the way, I love Earthworm Jim's one-liners. He's so he's so groovy. He really is. No wonder he's buds with Elvis. I'll race ya! I'll race ya! I'll race ya! Fudge, he's winning. All right. Oh no! Where is Colonel Pluckett? Holy cow! Where's Colonel Pluckett? I'm Gunnery Sergeant Mussolini. 
The Colonel has been captured and taken to our poultry of war camp. Under subsection 1 of the Farmyard Convention, paragraph 8, directive 97, I am obliged to return any items of underwear to the prisoner. Go ahead, take them. They don't fit me anyway. I was going to get debriefed and everything, now. Now I'm just going to get a load of bull. I'm just kidding, guys. I'm sorry. Hey, Calvin Cluck. Nice fabric. That guy's got taste. <laughs> Calvin Cluck. Calvin Cluck. I gotcha. See, some of this stuff I didn't even catch, even like a year and a half ago. You seem like a battle-hardened soldier. We could use your help. Take out the bomb-laying chicken upstairs, or we'll all mince meat. Never fear, I'll fry that bird in my own special blend of herbs and spices. Remember, soldier, when you dispatch that bird, report to me. Now move it! Alright. Okay. Yeah, do your little cutscene, I got you. Alright. So that's gonna be it for this episode. I'm probably going to roll right into the next episode, just so I don't lose all my marbles. <laughs> In more ways than one. <laughs> so, thank you all for watching. Like this video if you liked it. Dislike it if you disliked it. And as always... Peace! Bonk me!